Benvenuti all'Università del Gusto. Welcome to Università del Gusto. This is our chef Marco Perez. We will propose some very simple recipes which are all easy to prepare at home and the ingredients can be purchased at the corner shop any time of the year. The dish we're going to present today is spaghetti carbonara, definitely one of the most popular Italian pasta dishes. According to the class recipe, it combines diced bacon, the so-called flat kind of bacon, a bit of onion, parmesan cheese, eggs, and of course, a good quality spaghetti. As a first step, we need to separate the egg white, the albumin from yolk. If you could use three yolks for each person, that would be ideal, but two yolks each are already enough. Now, add the parmesan, a generous amount of black pepper, and the trickle of fine extra virgin olive oil. At this point we can start to cook the spaghetti. Boil the water, add a handful of cooking salt and the pasta. The pasta has to be al dente, which means slightly undone. While the spaghetti is cooking, we chop the onion in fine strips, a la julienne. Add a bit of olive oil and leave the sauté to cook over a low heat. Remember, the onion does not have to become brown, it has to be translucent. Add the bacon and simmer with white wine until reduced. This will give our carbonara a very pleasant and unique taste. It's now time to drain the pasta, but don't throw all the water away. Make sure you keep just a bit of cooking water, because that will be needed afterwards to complete the dish. Toss the spaghetti with the bacon and stir-fry shortly. Here is our yolks, our spaghetti, and we are now ready to pour it in the eggs. Mix it and add the remaining cooking water. Mix it well. Cook the pasta until creamy. This is technically called mantecare, and this way all the starch contained in the pasta will blend with the eggs and the parmesan. It will thicken, but it won't scramble. Just a bit of pepper. One more touch of pepper on top and season with a little oil if needed. And the carbonara is now ready.